How are you, Natalie and Moses? My name is Kata Balsano. Good, thank you. Thank you. Great. So um, first of all, I want to know, and this question is actually for, for, for both of you, you can answer uh, one after the other. Uh, what was it about Cleo Sherwood and Maddie Schwartz that made each of you say, yes, this role is for me? So juicy. So much to dive into. Uh, just like a really big swing, like one where you're like, is it going to work? Am I going to be OK? And then you do somehow. So it was great. Yeah, I loved that both characters were so well-rounded in terms of like you see their their energy and their positive aspects and their flaws and they're just human and it also really tells this kind of story about how someone can be both oppressed and an oppressor. The series and obviously the book touch on very relevant topics culturally, sociopolitically, uh, back in the 80s as well as Currently, you know, uh, the Jewish person and their portrayal in society, uh, the black struggle to progress and to and to you know be be taken in mind and taken into account. Um, what responsibilities did you feel in portraying these characters that even though they might be fictional because they're from a film, they do uh, you know they they do portray what many people live day to day in in, in reality. Well, I, I think that one of the things that's so interesting about looking at historical pieces is it informs a lot of where we are today. And I think it's the story of many American cities. Baltimore itself is a character in it where they were these thriving industrial centers that also had thriving and cultural lives and then industry left. And, you know, uh, of course, the it has ramifications of where we where we are today in many American cities um, and of course with these two communities that they live side by side and there's places where they overlap there's places where they unite and there's places where they're completely segregated from each other and and despite having many of the same challenges don't see in the other uh, uh, you know a companion I would agree with everything Natalie said um, and being true to what's on the page so always coming back to telling the truth, I think, is important. And what characteristics of each of your characters were you most focused on pushing through and having the audience notice about them? I don't know if I had one. Um, mainly just trying to present a whole person as much as I can, one that feels real, one that somebody feels like they've met at some point in their lives. Um, yeah. Yeah, I think the the beauty of making a series is that you have this time and space to explore so many different mm -hmm. aspects of a human that allows you to really know someone like a real person. And so it was lucky to work with Alma, a director who really created that space for exploration and nuance and and showing the wild sides and the, the timid sides and the extremities of, of a human's you know, being. Wonderful. Well, thank you both so much. It was a pleasure talking to both of you about it. Thank you. Thank you too. You.